All right, guys, welcome back to another random videos. And in this video, we have a woman who gets caught with an open bottle of liquor in her car. Yes, this is one of the dumbest uh, laws, rules, whatever I think that they have. Uh, you can't have an open bottle in your car, even if you're not drinking it. Just say you happen to forget it in your car and you get pulled over. You can get in trouble for it. I've seen people get uh, in trouble for it without even been been drinking at all. They just forgot it in their car. We got pulled over. Yeah, cops end up giving them a big ass ticket for it. And uh, the cop was like, well, I could take you to jail, but I'm not going to. And I'm like, that's like one of the stupidest rules I've ever heard. Even if you're not drinking, you can get in trouble for it. But yeah, I just don't get it, man. But yeah, let's get into the video. Bottle of alcohol right there, miss. On the ground there, can you hand that to me? There's an open bottle right there. Can you hand that to me? It's on the ground. Yes. No, no, stop. He said miss. Oh, miss? Yep. No, this is, um, this is not what I, I was drinking. This is old. <sighs> not. Okay. No. Hello, police department. Hi. Hi, I'm stopping you for speeding and then you're all over the road on South 41. You're swerving all in and out I'm of sorry, lanes. sorry, I was on my phone. He was busy drinking and driving. Going home. How much alcohol have you had to drink tonight? Not much. What's not much? I had a drink at the bar before I left my work. I can give you... You can tell right now that she is loaded to beyond uh, driving. Look at her. You can tell. You can see it in her face. Crazy, man. These people try to get out of it and lie. Give my ID right now. Okay, what what time was your last drink at? Ten Five minutes ago. ago. Okay, what kind of alcohol were <laughs> you drinking? Just a beer. Okay, can you be honest with me? I, I will be honest with you. I don't think so. I think you've had more than one to drink. I'll be honest with you, I did. Okay. I had one, two, uh, five. How many did you have? <laughs> You were honest with me about one. Time six. Two. How many did you really have? Because I'm telling you, I'm really good at this. You smell really bad like booze. You're slurring your speech. Your eyelids are droopy. How many did you really have? Uh, five. Five? Mm -hmm. okay. Can I see your driver's license registration, yes, please? Five times six, two. two nine dispatch. I'll take a 94 hey, routine. conversation with you? Yeah, I'll grab your ID first, and then we can talk. Okay. I just I really can't help you. Can I, can I, can we'll, we'll, talk about that. we'll talk about right. that. Okay, can what, we, what please, can we just have that conversation? Like, I can have my dad come. Hang on, what agency do they work for? The, the police, like, uh, Sh that. Hillsborough yeah. County. Hillsborough. What do they do there? She's, uh, my mom is a, um, sorry, I'm really scared right now. Secretary? Um, she's a, uh, Corrections officer, my dad and my mom are I'm retired just routine, um, please. police officers and okay. So they're not really police officers. They're retired corrections. Uh she's this woman's skating. No, she's just trying to get that get out free card, which is not gonna happen. I hope not. I haven't seen this video yet, but let's hope it not. It doesn't happen because she's hammered. Can I can, let's start with your driver's license, okay? Okay, can we, can we just, uh... Oh, let's not worry about your lights. Okay. This girl reminds me of those people that were in the protests. This is your, I your ID. My professional card. Lock her up! Just having to grab her license for me, and um, is that an open bottle of alcohol right there, miss? <laughs> on the ground there, can you hand that to me? There's an open bottle right there. Can you hand that to me? It's on the ground. Yes. No, no, stop. Oh, Lower. this? Yep. No, this is, um, this is not what I, what I was drinking. This is old. <sighs> I guarantee she was drinking that coconut <laughs> rum. Okay. Do you have any weapons in here for personal protection, miss? I promise you that not, and that mm -hmm. was not something I was drinking tonight. I'm not saying it was. Okay. Do you have a driver's license? I do, but Can I you don't have You're whipping out the passport. passport. I just had a, uh, a DUI the other day. I've been using my passport for the past uh, couple Is your license valid? 
It is. Okay. It is. Um, what's your first name? Abby? Abby McCoy. Abby, I'll have you hop out of the car, okay? Okay, so last beverage was 10 minutes ago. What time did you start drinking tonight? Please don't, please don't no, no, me. hang on. Don't please don't please remind don't me. me. <laughs> I didn't have you drink tonight. I didn't I have you start the vehicle. I didn't have you go 69 miles an hour to 45, swerving all over three lanes of traffic. Okay, okay, you did that, not me. So let's not put this on me. Okay, I'm just going to have you come up on the sidewalk, okay? I'm just going to ask you to perform a few... Uh, yeah, she's definitely. To make sure you're okay to she's going to jail. She's not and, sober. Uh, so can you stand on this flat and level surface here? I'm going to shut off these bright flashing lights, okay? No problem. I'm scared. Abby, I totally get it. Any police encounter, it's natural yeah. to be kind of scared or, or I, nervous. I, I Sounds like you, you said your parents are cops. I was on my phone. It's not more of a... Okay, here, I'll have you face this way. Okay. okay. I understand you were on your phone, but you're also doing 65 on laser, and then I get behind you, and I'm pacing you at 69. Okay? You're swerving 69. all over the traffic. You smell really bad like booze. You've had five drinks. Your last one was 10 minutes per drink. Girl. That's why we're at where we're at. Okay? Do you think you should have been driving tonight? Honestly, I probably should have called my dad. For a ride? And I honestly probably yeah. should have. I don't think I've left the bar more than two minutes. And Which bar are you coming from right now? Linksters. Linksters? I'm very scared. Okay. I so don't want to be in trouble. Do you do you have any head brain or eye injuries at all? I just wanted to leave the situation I was at. And <laughs> do you have any head brain or eye injuries at all? No. Okay. Do you wear contacts or glasses? Okay. Um I, do you take medications for anything? Okay. Do you have any lower back, knee, or hip injuries at all? Nothing, no ankle injuries. Okay. Um, all right. So what I'll have you do is I'm going to have you follow the tip of my pen right here. Can okay. you put your hands down by your side, please? Yeah. So what I'll ask you to do is voluntary exercise. Just follow okay. the tip of my pen right here with your eyes and your eyes only. Don't move your head at all. Do you understand? Yeah. Can you lower your chin a little bit? Thank you. Just right up here. The hell's all over her shirt? Or is that just a glare? These people always act like it's the end of the world to get a DUI. I mean, especially if you're drinking, your emotions are going to be a little bit up there, ratcheted up from the alcohol. But it's not the end of the world. People take the DUI, go back home, wake up the next morning, start your life anew, stop drinking and driving. Like I keep saying, I've been busted for this. And do you see me drinking and driving anymore? Sure don't. Uh, I hardly even drive my car anymore. I'm just one of those people who like to stay home all the time. Uh, I only drive when I have to go out. Uh, but yeah, just take it. Take it like like a man. You know what I'm saying? I know I hate using that expression, but just take it on the chin and just get over it, man. You'll get through it. Trust me. I had mine back in 2015, I believe. And here I am, happy as a jaybird. As a lark, whatever, however that saying goes. I think I probably screwed that one up, but yeah. I'm happy. Take a driving for the last five minutes. I understand that. <laughs> Let me know when you're right. It was just five minutes. It was just five minutes. And I, I don't want to ruin my life. Let I me don't know. want to ruin my life. Let me know when you're ready to continue, okay? I'll let you get control of yourself here. Can I, can I call my dad? No, I, not at this point. We're, I'm just wanting to do these exercises please, first, okay? okay. I, I'm just asking you to do these exercises first, okay? Get some of this exercise so, done. Put your hands by your side, please. I'm going to continue, okay? So follow the tip of the pen right here, okay? Mm -hmm. See your eyes jerking back and forth? I can see it. The stagnus test, yeah. They're jerking. So she's drunk. Yeah, you, you gotta follow it all the way to the side there. It's kinda it's weird to hold it to the side. So right. don't don't move your head at all. Follow with your eyes and your eyes only. I see him jerking like crazy. Go ahead and straighten your head out toward me. Thank you. There you go. Yeah. See that one? That one jerk? I 
Right there. You got to fall away right here. Tip of the pen. Sorry. It's okay. Tip of the pen right here. Yeah. Okay. Don't move your pen. So you're looking up and down on the pen. I know. Just follow the tip, tip okay? Tip, Just okay. the tip. Top of the Just the tip, man. Just the tip. See it? It jerked right there. It takes a little bit. And I say this takes a little bit. What are we looking for? Cause what am I Jerky looking? eyes. Oh, yeah. I'm looking for something. I, even, I know. So it's it goes in phases. I'm sure. I know. I've had like two days. I'm honestly just personally no, paranoid you you, no, you right said, now. You said you've had five. You did not say you had two. Do you I, but that's all night. And that's okay. been for the past four hours. I've just been... I'm paranoid that you pulled me over. I, I'm going to be honest. Do you want to be, be done honest. with this portion of the test? I, I am paranoid. You're scaring me. I'm scaring you? Just, just you... a little bit. Um, okay. I'm not used to this. I've never been pulled over before. Okay. This is a little bit nerve-wracking to me. Can you stand with her for just a second? Okay. I'm paranoid because I'm bloated. I don't want to be... What? Contradictory. I'm just scared. Sounds like to me this girl is used to a life of privilege. Uh, seriously, I'm not just saying that. Like, I'm not one of those people who throw that out there lightly. Uh, you can, I can almost tell that she acts like, uh, you know, oh, you know, it's another day for me. I'm a party girl, and you know, just go ahead and let me go. Mom and dad will help me out. Crap like that, man. Personally, I'm never going to People get nervous with police. But you don't have any reason to be nervous. I never get nervous with so police. I like to talking to the police. I don't know why, but I do. I, yeah, like I, I do. Okay. I was completely voluntary. Like I okay. don't feel like I'm in trouble at all. I just. Okay. Let's put your hands back. I'm down personally down. scared. Just I've never been like this. Okay. Okay. So let's have you finish this exercise. Sure, just, tip of the pen. Yep. Tip, tip of the pen. Yep. Okay. You've been doing fine. You've been doing fine with the direction. All right. Where'd he go to look up how to do it? And now we're gonna go up. This is the last portion of the exercise, okay. okay? Keep your head nice and low, fall it all the way up. Make sure to fall it all the way up. Okay, so the next exercise is called the walk and turn, okay? So we're going to use this flat and level surface right here, okay? Mm -hmm. We're not going to go up to that part because the sidewalk kind of pops out, I'm guessing, due to the yeah. tree roots, okay? So what I'll have you do is I'm going to ask you to put your left foot directly in front of you. Okay. Left foot, right foot directly in front, touching the toe. Like this? Right foot, right foot directly in front. Yeah. Your That's your left foot, Burrow. No, no, no. So left foot on that imaginary line, right foot directly in front, touching to the toe. There you go, I'll stop right there. Hands head against your side. Now please stay in that starting position until I ask you to begin, okay? So what I'm gonna ask you to do during this exercise is take nine toe to toe steps in front of you just like this. One, two, three. When you get to your ninth step, I'm doing three for demonstration purposes. When you get to your ninth, take a small series of steps to turn yourself around, staying on that lead foot, okay? okay? And then take nine toe to toe steps back just like this. One, two, when you get to your ninth step on the way back, the test is complete. A few things. It's important once you're starting to stop, um, step out loud, and each step is good until you understand. So one, two, three, count. Nine, nine feel the toe steps forward. Small series of steps to turn yourself around, staying on that. Mm -hmm. And then nine feel the toe steps back. Okay, and stay against your side. Heels and toes. Do you understand the exercise? Okay, begin when you're ready. No, nine. She's like, Lord, help me. Okay, so the last exercise I'm going to ask you to do is called the one-minute snack. Okay. <laughs> the 
She's not even trying. Oh, well, let her go okay. home if she's scared. <laughs> Here we go. Woo! You can call your dad once you get to the jail, okay? I respect that your parents are in law enforcement. I do. I really do. And I would like you to call your dad, but I, ha but I have to have you do that at the jail just like I do everyone else, okay? Can I just have like two minutes? I promise you, can I just have like two minutes? I need like two minutes! 6209 is going to have one white female, 215. Jesus. Get a grip. Try to flex his whatever he has. I don't want to ruin my life. But you got to understand, once I stop you for going so fast and you're all over the road, I'm talking all over the road. It's past the point where I can just say, uh, and you've got open alcohol in your car. Please tell me. Just please tell me I fucked up. You did. Please tell me I fucked up. You did make a mistake tonight. I'll do everything to him. I do not want to fuck up my life. I understand. I know. I know. I know. Would you give me permission to move your car so it doesn't get towed? Please, please. Would you give me permission to move your car so it doesn't get towed? Permission. Okay, is there anything that you need out of the car? Keys, phone, wallet, I have your phone. My liquor. Is there anything else you need? Just, just don't want this to happen to me. I understand, and I would feel the same way about some of your shoes. But you need to understand what I am not. Can you okay. give me a break? No. I'll give you, like, I'll, I'll, my dad will come. My dad will come. I'll stay on the side of the road. Okay. We won't have to do this. So, I'm going to ask Yes, we will. Or else we're gonna impound your car. I'm not like holding that against you. I'm just saying I would like to park it for you if you let me. Can I park your vehicle for you? Do you need anything out of it? Other than the keys? No? Okay. You can have this place. I'm just gonna move for coffee. Hang tight right here. I'm so sorry. We're beyond that girl. You ain't going home. Don't put it in her pocket, dude. So that it doesn't stay in your car. This cop better not put it in her pocket. She he better wait for the female officer to get here. Cause this girl, I can guarantee she's one of the type that's gonna lodge a complaint later on. He put his hands on my pants. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Wait for the female officer to come. Yeah. Don't be sticking money in her pockets. Dude. Um, what a dumb off. move. Slide that in the back pocket. What a dumb <laughs> move, dude. You got crazy females like this who are going to complain about that tomorrow. Don't grovel, man. You're going to regret it tomorrow when you watch this video. Or if you're seeing it when I'm doing it. Don't grovel, man. For real.
my dad. I just want my dad. Can you please call him? So you'll be able to call him whenever you get to the... Get to I don't want to go to... I don't want to go to Charles. I don't deserve to go to Charles. I want my dad to pick me up. So you'll be able to call him when you go to the jail. I mean, at this point in time, there's really not much we can do at this point. I didn't do anything. I swear to God, I didn't do anything. Dude, you're drinking and driving. I was two minutes away from where I was. I was just driving home. I get that you're two minutes away from where you were, but the thing is, he pulled you over because or for speeding, and then he made other observations that got to this point. Can, you, can I please call my dad before we get there? You... So you call him when you get to the jail. Can you call him? Uh, you can call him whenever you get to jail and handle, handle that. Girl, you ain't gonna manipulate your way out of this one. She's probably used to man manipulating people in her life. I guarantee it. They're never gonna forgive me. I don't think you're gonna be able to leave your car in here since it's owned by this place. So he's probably trying to find it where, you, where it won't get towed wherever he leaves it. They're never gonna forgive me. Your parents? Yeah, they will. They will. They will. They will. Technically, your parents don't have to find out. I don't think my dad even knows I got a DUI or my brother. If they watch this video, they'll find out. But this was back in 2015. I'm pretty sure they don't even know about it because, yeah. Because how are they going to find out? You know what I mean? Everybody makes mistakes. Don't forget you. Oh, they're giving me too many breaks. Which links do you work at? Oh, you work at the country club. After watching as many of these videos as I have, I don't feel no sympathy for none of these people. He's probably hoping that he gets her out of trouble, but it's not going to happen, girl. Oh, okay. He didn't put cash. Good. And I parked your car for you so it didn't get trouble, okay? I'm so scared. Please, can I just talk to my dad? Please. Please, can I just Oh, I'm just scared. Oh my god. I don't know why this is happening. Please. Perfect thumbnail right there. Please, can I call my dad? Call me when you get to the jail, that's not going to change. Can you spread your feet for me? Yep. Are you going to place it in your back or not? Okay. Okay. Right. Yeah, once you get to the jail and they book you, you'll be able to get your phone call, okay? There's a woman in the room. I'm scared. All right, man, that's going to be the end of this video. I have no sympathy for these people uh, who get busted drinking or driving. I uh, hope no one has sympathy for me when I got mine. Uh, you know what I'm saying? It was my fault. I should not have been drinking and driving. I was two sheets to the wind, dude. I blew a 0 0.198. I was hammered to beyond belief. But I was, you know, I could have um, not uh, got caught. But I was so drunk that I thought I had ran out of beer, and I didn't. I had like six or seven beers left in my little cabinet. And uh, so I went out to go get more. Then after I got busted for my DUI and came back home that night, uh, my wife was like, you know you had beer that was in this uh, cabinet over here. I'm like, are you kidding me? So I could have saved myself uh, 
a DUI if I would just looked in the cabinet and then, you know, kept drinking, but whatever. But yeah, I hope no one feels bad for me because I deserved it. I deserve to get my DUI. So this girl does too. All right, man. Tell me what you guys think about this video in the comments below. Until next time, peace. Hey, guys, if you really like these clips, give me a, a like, a share, and a follow on YouTube. All right, man? Peace.